LiveScribe Connect makes it easy to send and share notes and audio with people and destinations of your choice, all from your paper. Before you can send files with LiveScribe Connect, you must install the latest version of LiveScribe Desktop with LiveScribe Connect. If this is your first smart pen, you'll download the software from www.livescribe.com install. Otherwise, you'll be notified of the update from your previously installed version of LiveScribe Desktop. After installation, LiveScribe Desktop will automatically launch and you'll be prompted to connect your smart pen to your computer with the included USB cable. Do not disconnect your smart pen until the update has completely installed. After you've updated your computer and smart pen software, you can easily send notes and audio as pencasts with LiveScribe Connect. Let's get started! Make sure you've disconnected your smart pen and that it's turned on before we begin. First, we'll need to create a note with recorded audio. I'm going to explain each step and then show you how to do it. Tap the record button at the bottom left of your paper. You'll first write the number 1 at the top of your paper and say 1. Write a note. Then, jot down the word write after the number 1. You'll want to do it just like this. 1. Write a note. Next, you'll write the number 2 under number 1 and say 2. Select a note. Then, jot down the word select after the number 2. 2. Select a note. Finally, you'll write the number 3 under number 2 and say 3. Send a pencast. Then, jot down the word send after number 3. Complete the last step like this. 3. Send a pencast. Tap the stop button at the bottom left hand corner of your paper to stop your recording. To play back your recording, tap your handwritten numbers. 1. Write a note. 2. Select a note. Now, Let's send your notes and audio as a pencast PDF to your computer. First, find a blank area on your paper. Draw a line there and back again, about the length of the display on your smart pen. Your smart pen will react by asking for a command. Within 8 seconds of drawing your launch line, write the word PDF just above the line. Your smart pen now tells you to tap each page that you wish to send. Just tap your page of notes and you'll hear a beep from your smart pen. Finally, double tap the page with your smart pen. The next time you connect your smart pen to your computer, the pencast PDF will be sent to your computer. Once the smart pen indicates the file was sent, you'll find the pencast PDF on your desktop. Open the pencast PDF with the latest version of Adobe Reader to play the pencast and hear the recorded audio. Next, we'll learn how to control a pencast PDF opened with Adobe Reader. Click the play button in the control bar to play your pencast. One, write a note or you can click your handwriting to play your pencast from that moment in time. 2. Select a note. You can also use the other controls within the control bar to jump forward or back One. within your recording. Write a note. Click Two. or scrub within the bar to start playback between the beginning and end of your recording. You can choose to hide or show Two. the handwriting that Select hasn't been played back yet. Choosing to hide the handwriting before the audio playback could improve the pencast viewing experience. Adobe Send Now offers the option to easily email your pencast PDF as an attachment or send files up to 100 megabytes for free. You can also send pencasts with LiveScribe Connect using LiveScribe Desktop. Simply select your pages, then drag and drop them to the computer connector, and your pencast PDF will appear on your desktop. Selecting pages and using the right click feature is another method of sending notes with LiveScribe Connect. The more you use your smart pen, the better you'll get. Make sure that drawing a launch line with a command and double tapping pages works for you. 
If you're having trouble sending large pencasts over email, we recommend that you send your pencast PDF with Adobe Send Now.